Hi everyone, Alex Tardy from the National Weather Service office in San Diego, here for the weekly weather update. Uh, the main theme this week is below average temperatures. You've probably already noticed it uh, with cooler temperatures early this week that set in starting over the weekend. We are looking at a few showers uh, through Monday night and Tuesday morning. Otherwise, the next chance of rain is Thursday. That could linger into Friday morning as well. And uh, we could have a few pockets of heavier rain on Thursday, Thursday night. But after that, we go right into a warming trend, significant warming trend for the weekend. Let's take a look at a few things. So for Tuesday, temperatures again, much below normal, 10 to 20 degrees below normal almost everywhere. Uh, our mountains will feel the coolest temperatures only in the 60s. Our desert's still mild in the 80s, but that's still much below normal. Along our coastal metro areas, it's going to feel like a marine cool summer day. Temperatures really only in the 70s and Inland Empire upper 70s. Now I talked about the chance for rain on Thursday. Coming down from the north, uh, a low pressure system in the upper part of the atmosphere will bring showers. This will mostly affect coastal areas, but we'll see some of these showers move into our inland valleys and even our mountains. So a good chance of rain on Thursday could be a better chance than what we saw early this week. The exception will be our desert areas. We don't expect much at all. Now, temperatures will remain cool on Thursday as this next upper level storm and cold front reinforces the below seasonable averages that we're looking at. So that means uh, 80s in the deserts, 70s in the inland valleys, and only in the 50s for our mountain areas, uh, such as Big Bear and Wrightwood, due to the much cooler air uh, with the specific storm dropping over Southern California. So what's bringing our weather and our big changes? So we came out of a heat wave in early September severe heat wave which brought record hot temperatures now from left to right we're dealing with two upper level low pressure areas storm systems off the pacific now they don't have a lot of moisture with them they don't have a lot of instability but nonetheless they're unseasonably cool for this time of year dropping this far south so you can see early this week the storm system was right over central southern california and it'll be followed by another similar storm system the same track almost moving across Central California into uh, Las Vegas area. So those are the two weather makers that are bringing the wind in the mountain passes that'll bring the much cooler temperatures through this week uh, and will bring the next chance for rain on Thursday. Here are some resources to take a look at. Uh, if you're looking for the latest alerts that we issue, they're on weather.gov. You can also find precipitation on water, NOAA.gov. And if you want a detailed weather forecast for your backyard, check out the weather forecast points link here with the arrow. By the way, we're also on X, YouTube, and Facebook. You'll see some of our latest information posted on there. All right, everyone, enjoy the cooler weather uh, and be safe. Thank you.